Cinderella was a kind, caring girl who lived with her bossy stepmother and two lazy stepsisters who were extremely spoiled. They were very mean to Cinderella, making her wear old rags and do all the cooking and cleaning. Cinderella's only friends were the cat and mice who lived in the kitchen. One day, a royal invitation arrived. Can you help open the royal invitation by tapping on the golden envelope? The prince is hosting a ball to find the girl to marry, announced the stepmother. The prince is seeking a wife? Me! Me! cried the stepsisters. May I go to the ball? asked Cinderella quietly. Certainly not, Cinderella, they said. You shall stay home and finish your work. On the day of the ball, the stepsisters were bossier than ever, ordering Cinderella to do everything. Later, as Cinderella was gardening, a bright light appeared. Tap on the screen to see what happens. It was her fairy godmother. Cinderella, she said. You shall go to the ball. Cinderella was amazed. Me? But how would I get there? She said. Aha, said the fairy. Just bring me a cat, some mice, and a large pumpkin. Cinderella gathered everything together. Can you help Cinderella collect the cat, mice and pumpkin by tapping on each of them? The first wave of the fairy's wand transformed the pumpkin into a spectacular golden carriage. Swish! Tap on the wand to see what happens. The second wave turned the mice into magnificent horses. Swoosh! Tap on the wand to see what happens. And the third wave, the cat became a dapper footman. Whoosh! Tap on the wand to see what happens. Thank you, fairy godmother, said Cinderella. But what shall I wear? Can you swipe Cinderella to see her rags transform into a beautiful ball gown? With a final whoosh of the wand, Cinderella's rags were transformed into a beautiful ball gown. And on her feet, she wore dainty glass slippers. Furry godmother, how can I ever thank you, said Cinderella. Just promise you'll return before midnight, said the fairy godmother. Because at midnight, the magic will end. And Cinderella sped off to the ball. At the ball, Cinderella looked so different that even her stepsisters didn't recognize her. The prince and Cinderella danced all night 
and he soon realised she was the nicest girl he'd ever met. Cinderella was enjoying herself so much, she forgot the time. The clock began to chime midnight. Cinderella suddenly remembered the fairy's warning. At midnight, the magic will end. Can you tap on the clock 12 times to hear the midnight chime? One. Two. Three. Four. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Well done. With no time to even say goodbye, Cinderella dashed to her waiting carriage. In her hurry, one of her shoes fell off. The prince ran after her, but it was too late. Cinderella was gone. All that remained was the glass slipper. The next day, the prince desperately searched the kingdom for the mysterious girl who dropped her shoe. The girl whose foot fits this slipper he announced, is the girl that I love and will ask to marry. Finally, the prince arrived at the house. Cinderella was worried that one of her stepsisters would fit the slipper. Can you help the stepsister try on the glass slipper by dragging it to her foot? But their feet were too big. At last... It was Cinderella's turn. Ha! It will never fit her, scoffed her stepmother. Can you tap on the prince to help him put the glass slipper on Cinderella's foot? But to everyone's amazement, the slipper did fit Cinderella perfectly. The prince immediately recognised her from the ball and asked Cinderella to marry him. Cinderella was overjoyed. She married the charming prince and took her faithful friends to live with them in the royal palace. Can you help throw confetti over Cinderella and the prince by blowing into your device? The end.